Matthew Tate high and into the arms of Ruin Pinar. Yeah. Ian Humphreys. And he chases the kick. And is he going to get the tackle in on Adam Thompson? A, a really strong pumping handoff on Luke Marshall, but then swamped again by white shirts. And the Ulster fans are really appreciating the endeavour. And then the turnover. Here's Aaron O'Connor. And Leicester will have to be quick here to reset their defence because there's lots of Leicester players on the ground on this near side here. They've got to fill those holes on the open side. And there's a hole for Ian Humphreys. And it's the caveman who scores again. Well, now it is getting desperate for Leicester. And again, you know, Humphreys just suavely goes through the gap there. And Darren Cave picks a lovely, lang a lovely angle there. I was thinking in that attack. You wouldn't think Ulster are out of contention because they're playing with so much heart and pride. But I think, you know, because they are out, they're not under pressure. Leicester are under pressure. They're making the errors. Ulster, without the pressure, just flowing into their game. Super little break there from Humphreys. Draws two to him. And Darren Cave just waits, comes off the line and in there for the score. Leicester looking under pressure. That's a lovely play. Are we hearing a potential yeah. knock-on in the ruck? We are. C'est bon, eh? Ils sont tout courants. C'est bon. I think uh, once Philippe Bonheur, the TMO, in our trucks to have a look here. And it's a knock-on in the ruck. We are told. And uh, Pinar no. picks that up cleanly. Uh, well, you, you see, it really should be clear and evident because if they're looking for a knock on in the ruck, they should be seeing that. The referee's in a great situation. Certainly nothing from, from, from uh, Ruin Pinar's hands there. Nothing clear is an obvious for the knock on. I may award it No, it's a try. It's nothing clear and obvious. You're quite right, Stuart. I'll say that then, it's not clear and obvious. The referee is about 40 metres closer than the assistant referee who's called it. It's not that obvious, so why is he calling it? That is not what the TMO is called for there. You know, they've got to see it. It causes problems. It's one of those things you chat to Nigel Owens, it drives him mad. He wants